Top of the morning, welcome back to Island in the Box Catering. This morning I will be making some oats porridge, as you can see here, I'm tossing some oats into my blender, and as well as some flax seeds. Now, if this is your first time joining, please like, share, subscribe on my YouTube channel, and follow me over there on Instagram as well, at Island in the Box Catering. All right, you guys, this is one of my favorite breakfasts to make. It's hearty, it holds you throughout the day. As you can see, I'm adding some oat milk here, but you can use any milk of your choice. Let me just don the box, shake out everything. Me no yes, nothing. All right, I'm going to be also incorporating some uh, sea moss. I boil and blend it out myself. I like to have that in my oats and basically in my tea, everything basically that it's, you know, I can put it in, I incorporate it. It's a good source of vitamins and minerals. All right, so I'm just gonna shut down the top of this blender and blend this all out. If you guys are seeking a caterer in the Massachusetts area, link me up, all that information is in my description box on both social media platforms. All right, so I'm just going to scrape everything out of the blender cause we don't waste nothing around here, we waste nothing at all. Can use some milk and shake out the rest of the remains of the oats in the blender into the pot. I want to make sure I scrape up everything. I don't know where you're your light, like I All right. So, feel that I get out everything. Let's just put that to the side. All right. So, now I'm going to add some coconut milk. I found some coconut milk that is dairy-free. It doesn't have all the gum paste and all that other stuff in it. So, yeah. Keeping it healthy as possible. So, I'm just going to incorporate some of that for now. Mix that in proper, proper, proper. And now I'm going to add some cinnamon. I'm using a quarter teaspoon of cinnamon. Definitely get that in there. Got to flavor my pot with my spices. That's all we do. We don't know already. As well as some nutmeg. Can't have uh, porridge without the nutmeg. Definitely going to incorporate a quarter teaspoon of that as well into that. And I'm going to also add a quarter teaspoon of vanilla. And now it does depend on the size of the pot that you're making, but because my pot is small, I'm just using a quarter teaspoon. And as well as some almond extract. Now I'm gonna use less, okay, of the almond, because it's really strong. All right, and just a bit of salt as well. Just a little bit of salt, not too much. So some even stuck in at a spoon, so that's good. Now you're gonna stir that up, stir it up like Bob Marley said. Yeah, anyways, back to the pot. Gonna add some more milk to my pot because you can see the oats is very thick. And I like my porridge in between. I don't like it too thick and I don't like it too watery, but you can have it at any consistency that you choose, all right? If you guys are seeking a caterer again in the Massachusetts area, I want you guys to link me up, follow my page and my channel. I'm going to incorporate the rest of this coconut milk in now. I love when my porridge is well, like have that coconut taste. It's just, mm, it just speaks heaven to my taste buds. All right, so that looks so nice and rich and creamy. Yes, may I tell you no, it's sell off. All right, so fast forward the video. I'm going to add, oh, that's too big. I'm going to use, um, quarter cup of brown sugar just a quarter cup of brown sugar now you can use any sweetener you would like just a quarter cup of that and a stir that in and it's dark brown sugar for me but like I said you can use honey uh, you can use any type of sweetener of your choice gonna mix that in very well make sure I get that sugar dissolved properly Yes, you see all that nice and rich? Strong back porridge, that may I say. <laughs> anyways, anyways. All right, so I'm going to add a little bit of condensed milk. Just a little bit, not too much. You know, it's very rare I use condensed milk in my porridge, but I try to stay away from these things that cause so much mucus in the body. All right, so I'm just going to mix that out. And I think it's the, you know, like I said, you can sweeten your pot to your liking up to you so this is done I'm gonna turn off the stove and get this porridge plated now again don't forget to like share and subscribe over there on my YouTube channel and as well and follow me on Insta the gram all right I will add weird to the gram all right so let's pour this porridge out let's dish this out mm-hmm yes this smells so 
good, you guys. Oh my goodness. And it, it's definitely fulfilling. And as well, as you can see, I'm going to add some Jamaican water crackers. It's a classic to go with the porridge. It's just absolutely tasty, fulfilling, healthy, and hearty. All right, you guys, there you have it. This is my version of oatmeal porridge. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and follow. Bye.